Hey, welcome to All Things SEO with Jay. Today, I'm going to explain why you should be using Cloudflare, the benefits of it, and how to install Cloudflare so that your website go, does becomes a little bit faster. So there's several things that Cloudflare does. Uh, it protects your internet presence, obviously, security, performance, and reliability. The reason why I want you uh, recommending Cloudflare is the, the performance. And um, if they, cl they do claim that your website is going it's going to be one second faster so it's 66 percent faster uh, compared to your standard hosting provider and all the WordPress installation and plugins and so on so I did a test here um, and to see if there's a, a big difference I didn't install any plugins I didn't install any um, themes or have any content or images so this is plain vanilla so this is going to be right out of the box very fast so 69 percent um is through the lighthouse audit on gt metrics you're looking at 1.7 seconds in canada and close to the server which is in washington it's going to be 700 milliseconds and the gift of speed is claiming 1.01 second loaded. So benefit of Cloudflare, you could see a little bit of significant changes. Uh, just because this is a plain vanilla WordPress, nothing has been installed. You, could, uh, you won't see that much of an improvement because this is already somewhat fast, but you could kind of see the, the difference uh, and the claim that they're, they're making 66% faster. So let's get to the how to install Cloudflare. So once you sign up for Cloudflare, it's going to ask you to add a website. So click on the website, uh, click on the button, and then you're going to add your website. So I'm going to copy my URL and add the website. Make sure you don't have any HTTPS or trailing slash. And you're going to just select free. Okay, scanning the DS code, make sure everything's proxy, everything's lined up. And then what we're gonna do is we're gonna replace these and add this one. So I'm going to go to my Namecheap uh, place and go into the, the website manage settings. And I'm going to click on custom DNS. Now uh, some domain uh, provider that you're using is gonna just locate the section where it says name server and you should be able to add a custom DNS and replace it so I'm gonna copy and paste copy and paste so once that's saved you want to go done check name server and in this section, this section, you want to click on full and always use HTTPS enabled. Click done. And then you're going to go to SSL and click on edge certification. And we're going to change the HSTS settings. Click on I understand and make sure this is enabled. Click on speed. Optimization. Click on rocket loader. And that's pretty much it. So once you're done, uh, it could take a couple minutes to a couple hours uh, for your dom domain provider um, to connect Cloudflare and Cloudflare to connect to your name, uh, name server. So we're, what we're going to do is just wait a bit, and then I'm going to do a performance test to see the difference and to see if it actually helps. Okay, so... 
I've installed Cloudflare and I did a another test to see the difference. And as you can see here, performance is now 70. I took a screenshot before and that it was previously 69 for Lighthouse Audit. And if you go on GT Metrics, it's 1.7, so nothing has changed. Mm -hmm. Uh, just only the request is different because it goes to the CDN, the Cloudflare first before going to your site. That's how it works. And in the Pingdom tests, it didn't improve. It actually went bad, uh, just 90 milliseconds, so not that much of a difference. Gift of speed is now 90. 900 millisecond compared to 1.01. So um, the, obviously it doesn't give you a significant difference because there is nothing to change for this website. But if you do install your themes, your images, your art, all the articles and more traffic to your to your site, it, it goes off percentage. So what Cloudflare does is try to trim all that by caching your website so that it feeds off. Uh, it doesn't gather too much data from your website, but it already has all that data to show uh, your visitor. So once uh, it does produce about 66% uh, faster. So if you have five seconds, it could be like three seconds or uh, or something in those long. In, in, in those lines so um, so the more you add um, the more percentage you'll see the the difference you see versus uh, me having a plane nothing has been installed nothing has been touched and running this test because the test kind of shows you just a, like what it does compared to what it can do uh, for your existing website. So if you like this video, make sure to like it. If you have any questions or any suggestions for any video related to Cloudflare or speed, uh, do let me know so I could create videos for you. And uh, please also make sure to hit the subscribe button. And thank you for watching this video.